guys, this is Casey Israel again, and today, um, this is video game looking? I really don't have the money to go out video game hunting, unless it's something extremely cheap. I just, I'd save quite a bit of money to get my car worked on. And I know AJ and Tex, they're, you know, like, you know, Give me a little grief because you know you could have done it yourself. Like I just want to enjoy my first four days. I'd rather have someone work than me. And what about the cool about this one shop I did? Stuff I knew one I needed brakes, and I was pretty sure it was the rear ones. And um. They were, they took pictures of everything, and they seemed honest to me, and I looked at it, looked it over, looks good to me, so, I mean, they earned my trust, even though it was a hell of a lot more expensive than it was last time around, but um, luckily, I saved enough money money to do that. Now I gotta go and I owe my mom a little bit more than usual because I had to save money to do this. But, um, I'm just glad. I was starting to get embarrassed by my car where it was screeching. I was like, oh god, I did not want to go nowhere because of that. Now it's um, looks good, sounds pretty good. Um, sounds a lot quieter. Um, so I don't feel as embarrassed driving around not anymore. I can actually feel peaceful as I drive. So, um, uh, actually, this was a pretty bad day. Um, Mom wasn't feeling too good today, so she was feeling pretty dizzy, so she had to go to the hospital. She'd get these spells, something like that, where she gets dizzy and weak and she was good for a long time. This is the first time in a long time she had one of these episodes. So, right now she... Actually, I need to give her a call, see how she's doing. I've been sleeping a lot. I took about a couple hour nap. So, um... The other thing that sucked, I realized today, when I was trying to locate... No, oh, I was going to take my Switch with me, just in case. I don't know if I was going to be there for a while. And I noticed my... I'm missing three cases full Switch games. I probably just lost half my Switch games. Because it turns up missing. Uh, I looked everywhere I know it where it should be. I checked my room, checked the game room, checked the collection room, couldn't find it. It wasn't just, see, I had two little cases that came with, that hold Switch games that came with my Switch case, and I bought this big one that holds a lot more than that, and it barely fits in the zipper pocket, and you had to really work to get that thing out, so I checked, like, like I said, my room and stuff, and now, like I said, half, all of my good games are really gone now, so... I hate to think someone 
actually came in and stole it. But I'm to the point, I think it actually happened because, well, there was a case. Like I said, the bigger one barely fits into the zipper pocket in there. And it's a bitch to put it in. It's a bitch to take it out. The other one's could have slipped somewhere easily. It's been on my dresser a lot. It's been in the uh, game room a lot. And I it had like four loose games in there. So luckily I still had those. But... I lost a ton of games now. I might just tear under the coffee table, but I hate to say someone came in the house and stole, but I don't know. It's kind of hard. Like, at work, like, I try to be not to say someone stole this, a lot of times I'd be like, I would blame myself, say I misplaced it. And a lot of times I would be correct. I'd be the one who misplaced it. And I was like, that's why a lot of times I wouldn't blame anyone except myself. But there's a lot of, that's a big reason why I think someone did. Because it's not like, like, one's poking out somewhere, or two of them's poking out, and then the other one's missing. They're gone. So, that's what sucks. So, right now, I, one, I want to check out the game store anyways. Two, if there's a bunch of loose Switch games that look like could have been my games. Uh, like, I'm gonna ask them, say, hey, did someone have like three? I think there's two red cases and a blue Zelda case. That's what I had. So I was like, a little depressing. Because now, like, just lost a ton of Switch games. That I had, and now feeling like God, someone, I, if it actually truly happened, now I'm like I'm always paranoid about people coming in the house, anyways. And now I found something that apparently it could have been stolen. I hate thinking that could happen. I rather oh, I misplaced it. But here's the reason I think why because four of those games, those games were still there, while the other three were gone, long gone. So I was like, I don't know. I hate to think about that, but. And I don't want to tear down the whole game room and tear down, even though there's, I just checked behind the dresser and under the dressers in my room. Hate to dump all the stuff out of my couple bags in my room, but I might just resort to doing that. I mean, what the fuck? I hate when, like I say all the time, when someone goes side to side with me. <sighs> but, I think on a resort, if I don't see, like, a bunch of games, loose games at the game store, then I'll be like, or if I see the cases, uh, I would like, oh my god, I, like, I, like, I had to tell him, it's like, I don't know who brought that in, but those are mine. All those games were mine, too. I hate to do that. Like, I lost Splatoon 3, 
I can tell you which one's the biggest ones right now. It's the bigger names. Like, Pikmin 3's gone. Uh, Splatoon 3's gone. Uh, uh, Mario Odyssey's gone. The, the Mario games are gone. I got Splatoon 2. But... And I say Mario Kart 8 Deluxe is gone. What really bothers me, like Pikmin 3, Breath of the Wild's gone. Mario Odyssey's gone. That's what really bothers me. Plus, oh god, the. That Zelda game, uh, Age of Calamity, that's gone. I think that's gone. I might. There's a few games I changed in and out. Hopefully, that I just. I don't remember putting all those stuff back. I. Hopefully, I did. Hopefully, I misplaced it. Hopefully, no one actually stole from me. That would be the worst. That someone actually stole from me like that. But, gosh. I know people are like, oh, that's first world problems. Or, oh, someone stole from me, Casey. Oh, boo-hoo. I'm like, dude, I'm a collector, and I collect this shit, and you come in my house and steal from me? That's fucked up. So, but, like I said, I had no proof yet. I'm like, I didn't check every little thing, like, in those two rooms. Like, I didn't dump all the bags and I didn't tear underneath the the coffee table but I got a bad feeling it's long gone but I'm at the game store and I hate to see if I find it here so hopefully you guys will be hearing from a better news Point later on, but I'll be back.
so I got out of the game store. Didn't see any evidence of finding anything over there. Uh, vintage stock. They had a bunch of loose Switch games. But I noticed a couple that looked like could have been mine, but then there's a lot of other loose ones, so I was like, not 100% positive, and, uh, couldn't read them all, so, I only could read a couple, so, really have no proof and I didn't see, like, the casing anywhere, but that doesn't mean that you couldn't just sold the cases separate or, or toss the cases. But, um, but I did pick up a couple games, even though as I wasn't planning to set and not buy anything. They were cheap. I bought two Atari 5200 games related. I actually just did uh, one of them. I rebought my Cuber in the box. <laughs> and it has all the stickers on it still. And I know it was one because it has all the stickers. And this one says from AIM. Oh wow. Chug. Another one looks like it's Centipede. I don't know if I had Centipede. I'm pretty sure I did. Because I collected most of the 5200 games that was around this area. So. Alright, I'll check one more spot. But, it, it's just definitely questionable. I, I feel like someone I know took them. But, there's more than other people could have done it that I know has switches. So, I'm not blaming one person just yet. Alright. Until, especially until <laughs> someone says, how's my driving? Dial 1-800-FUCK-OFF. Uh, hey, that, well, no. The number, I mean, I guess it would be fun, right, because, you know, the K would be over to the other side of the numbers. But I guess that could be a real phone number. <laughs> That's hilarious. But, like I said, I hate to not, I hate to blame someone, when, especially when uh, I'm known to misplace stuff. So. Uh, when I hit one more store, then I'll show you when I get to the new stop the two things I pick. Maybe I'll, it's unlikely at the next finish that I'll find something. I mean, it's unlikely, but it could happen. I think I actually sold some cool stuff over there last time I was thinking about popping on. But right now, how much I just spent, I shouldn't paid more than what I just did. So. It's a bummer, bro. I mean, I'm a little happy that I got my car worked on. It's done, and I'm not embarrassed to drive around with it no more. Because it feels crazy. But I'll be right back. Alright guys, so this is actually the next day. I was planning to do this when I got home, but other things happened. So um 
Yes, I still couldn't find those Switch games. I literally lost half my Switch games now. I did recut. What's weird, I found four loose games. And it sucks how tiny these games are. And these are all, not four of them that I found. And honestly, the best half is missing. So, uh, only the, the best one that I was able to recover was Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. I swore I thought that was the one would be gone too. But no, I was able to get my Mario Kart 8 Deluxe um, recovered. Uh, let's see what else. Um, a lot of them, I, yeah, I lost. A lot of my good ones are long gone. It sucks. I don't... Yeah, a lot of the main hitters are gone. Try and find where the other ones... I'm, get, I'm telling you right now, when I get my... It, let's say if I stumble across it, uh, I will put them back in their cases. Another one I was able to find was... Uh, Captain Toad Treasure Tracker. I was able to get that one. Uh, actually, I think two of them might be down there because I was sure. That I saw them, so. It's gonna suck the ones I show you. That are missing. So I'll be right back. Give me a second. Alright. The other one. Is Splatoon 2. That I was able to recover. But Splatoon 3. Is not. The last one I was able to recover. Is Atari Flashback Classic. So. Like I said. I lost about half my collection. I'll show you. Quick picture of all the ones I missed. These are all the ones I lost now, so yeah. That sucks. And those are the ones I was able to, that I kept the games in there, so yeah. That sucks. Alright. Let me show you, before I show you the ones that I lost, let me show you something good on the good end. I picked up a couple of Tar 5200 games in their boxes. Actually, I had this one before. This is the one I had before I resold all my Atari 5200 stuff again. Uh, they didn't really process it yet. But it still has all the stickers uh, from it from being uh, reduced. You got aims on it. It's been reduced from whatever the first sticker price was down to twenty nine ninety eight, down to twenty bucks, down to fifteen, reduced all the way down to three dollars when this was. Finally, guess someone finally bought it. And it opens up. It has the manual. It's got game, too. So, I will be selling this one now. Uh, and they also had Centipede in its box. Let's open this one up. And it was cool. It comes with a box protector. 
the box is in very poor shape, but how old it is. Centipede looks, the cartridge looks great. It has the manual, too. That's awesome. Yeah, there's the manual for it. So, but the box is in horrible shape, but, God, I think this box is about at, at least as old as I am. Yeah. 1982, so this thing right here is 41 years old, so, yeah, the box is not going to be in the greatest shape. Well, what's weird, this one, looking at the year, trying to find the year on this one, 1983, so this is 40 years old, but I feel this box is a lot made, it's a lot stronger than this box, this is more flimsy than this one. So I'm actually pretty happy about these games. So those will go over down there now, where the other ones are. So give me a second, I'll do that right now. I place it under where the 5200 games is right here. Because there's a space, so I was like, yeah, I'll put them closer where they are. Um, that's where I keep my Odyssey 2 games, but there's just a little space, so that I'll put it right there. So, all those... Sorry. So, let's go through the games that I lost. There's quite a bit. There, one of them Zelda Skyward HD, Super Mario 3D All-Stars, that's going to be a bitch, because they don't make this no more. Raymond's Legend, the definite, uh, definitive edition. Here's a big one. Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. This is a cool one that I just lost. It's Aladdin and the Lion King in a, say, Genesis type box. Wolfenstein 2. Sonic Mania Plus. I recently played this game on the, on the PS5, but I played it on the PS4. It was Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy. Lost that one, but um, not a good game. Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. I can play this on the Wii U, but same, well, same with a couple others, but here's a big one. Splatoon 3. Lost that one. Uh, like I said, some of the biggest hitters are gone. Like this one. Breath of the Wild. I can play the Wii U version right now if I want to play Breath of the Wild, but honestly, I'm going to want it back on the Switch. Mortal Kombat 11. This one hurts right here. It really does. Pikmin 3 Deluxe. The uh, Mega Man X... Collection plus X2 collection. I re I didn't even realize this must have been cheap. That I didn't realize I actually had this one. Doom 2016. Uh, this one I was sure I had Mega Man Legacy Collection one and two. Super Mario Party, the first one, the one that a lot of people are not a fan of, Mega Man 11, New Super Lucky's Tale, oh, this is a tired one, this one hurts too, Luigi Mansion 3.
This is a good game. It sucks lost this one, too. This was Super Mario Rabbit's Kingdom Battle. Street Fighter 30th Anniversary Collection. SNK 40th Anniversary Collection. Feels like there's something in there, but nope. I thought there might have been manual. Another one hurts right here. Yoshi's Crafted World. God dang it. Link, uh, Zelda Link's Awakening. Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. Oh! The better one. Mario Party Superstars is missing. Now we're hitting all the Mario games. Mario Odyssey is gone. Super Mario U Deluxe is gone. Even though I can play this on the Wii U. Half this game I can play on the Wii U. The other half I can't. Is Super Mario 3D World plus Bowser Fury. So I can play half of this right now if I wanted to, but... I can't play the better half as Bowser Fury, but literally, look at this. This whole fucking stack I just lost. That's quite a bit of fucking money that I just lost. So, that sucks. And I looked for a while. So, sadly, I, like I said, I usually don't want to say someone came in and stole something, but... It finally happened. Someone stole something out of the collection, so. Hopefully that's not true. Hopefully I'll stumble across it. It'd be great if I do. If I stumble across it. But. That sucks. But. And these are the, like I said, are the ones that I recovered, so. Four games. So. Like I said, it's about half I just lost. I had quite a bit of a Switch collection, too, so. That sucks. So, I'm thinking about what I'm going to do is going to head and turn around and sell these. Maybe I get a few bucks, I don't know. We'll see. So, I'll see you guys in a little bit.